Check it out. Helicopter overflights on November 30th, December 1st, and December 2nd allowed for aerial, visual, and thermal imagery to be collected on the Northeast Rift Zone. Yeah, so the thermal camera that we use from the helicopter is used to map the flow outlines accurately because they're warmer than the surrounding lavas. So it gives us a very accurate way to tell where all the flows are. Now these maps show the evolution of the lava flow from Fisher 3. That's this one. As of Saturday, it remains the dominant Fisher and the only active one feeding the flow. Which is now um, narrowed down to a single vent and is uh, continuously fountaining and has built a cone that's about 150 feet tall. So let's take another look at these new maps. The color scale ranges from blue to red, with the blue colors being an indication of cooler temperatures and the red colors being a sign of warmer temperatures. Here's how HVO's scientist in charge, Ken Han, described how the lava is moving today. Slowly creeping across that area, it continues to spread out and uh, our modeling suggests that it will continue to spread even more and thicken on here and go very, very slowly. Models run uh, that go run out as far as two weeks from the beginning of the eruption still don't have it touching the saddle road. These are only approximations though. There's a lot of things that can happen in that flat area in the saddle. Um, the, the flow could branch, the flow could uh, branch up slope of it. Um, so. We are uncertain as to what the, the ultimate uh, direction that the flow will go, whether it goes down to the east or goes over to the uh, west. So those are just all kind of on our wait and see items right now. A big thanks to USGS who continues to supply us with some amazing imagery. And don't forget, if you like looking at this stuff, just head to our H&N digital platforms. We have a gallery there of hundreds of photos that have been submitted to Hawaii News Now. Again, that's on your H&N digital platforms. I'm Jonathan Sherrod Sapi reporting.